With all of our guests now gone from the property, I decide to send Billy and Jay back inside to sweep the area with the XLS camera. Aaron and I feel lethargic, so we decide to investigate remotely from the car to see if we can document evidence of any attachment. Jay and Billy are inside. I want to tell and remind everybody that the XLS camera that they're using, it is extremely hard for that camera to map in false positives. Yeah. Anything yet? Nothing yet. What's that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Was, dude, I just saw something glowing right here in front of me. I thought it was... Shh, shh, did you hear that? Yeah. Is that upstairs? Yeah, that's upstairs. That was someone full on like running. Somebody in here? Very loud footsteps can clearly be heard above Jay and Billy, and they are captured loudest on this X camera. Billy immediately races upstairs to see if anyone else is in the building with them. Anybody up here? Jay, there's nobody up here. There's literally no one up here. I just ran up here as fast as I could, and there's nobody up here. I swept the entire upstairs. There is nobody up here. And I know that we, we heard someone up here walking. It is absolutely chilling for them to hear such loud footsteps that were also captured on our camera's audio. As Billy was upstairs, Jay had something thrown at him. I'm coming, Jay. As soon as we came in here, Zach, there was something running upstairs. We could hear the footsteps. I ran up there as quick as I could. There's nobody up there. And Jay had something thrown at him when I was upstairs. So it's highly active in here and dangerous. Okay. Aaron and I start using the polter pod just outside to see if we can connect to the spirits that are making themselves known to Jay and Billy. Can you tell me who's in the building right now? The what? The hell was that? Dude, that was weird. That was weird. What is amongst us? Unholy. Unholy. Do run. Do run. Look. I've never seen that. What? Unholy. Do run. After Are you serious? Yes. Is this a warning for Jay and Billy to run and remove themselves from the building because there is something unholy with them? Shoot over here, maybe next to these stairs. What was that? Oh. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. It was back here. That was in that room. Exactly. Something is moving over there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. There's literally something moving over there. Something is moving. Something is moving. Yeah. You do something else? Jay and I are actually frozen right now. Oh, we have a camera all the way across the room. See this this camera here? The noises are coming from directly behind the camera. As much as Jay and Billy keep asking the figure to appear, it never does. Nothing, Jay. I, I, it's mapping you. But when Jay leaves the room, Billy continues aiming in that direction, and this very strange shaped figure appears right in the center of the room. Whoa! As we have mapped unexplained XLS figures in the past, we have never seen anything that is shaped like this. 
You were completely out of frame, Jay. Yeah. This thing just for a split second, this weird ass shape hitting right in the middle of the room. You were, you were, you were over here. Yeah. Wow. Zach, we got it. We got him. Listen, seven foot thing mapped in. Dude, it was so creepy. I don't want to push this anymore, man. We got what we needed. Why don't you guys head out? With the most unusual XLS capture we have ever seen, along with the countless noises, the anomalies, our guest Vincent being strongly affected, then the only Polterpod voice we ever captured was his name being called out right after he left the building. We feel we have documented strong, compelling evidence of something truly negative that is residing underneath this historic building with a dark past. It is now time to completely switch gears and head over to investigate the bowling alley. Oh, this is so weird. I've always wanted to be back in here to see what this looks like. It's kind of scary. Hey, I've heard that there's sightings of a man in here. And I know that this... Here, I remember we're still affected from the last investigation we just did. So coming from there to here, switching gears, it's completely different energy, and my body is in the process of calibrating itself right. back. But already I feel better just being here than there. It's completely different energy. Do you feel the energy that we have brought over here from that dark, evil building? Did we bring with us attachments here? Do you see those attachments? Olive, I know you're a little girl. This is where you stay. We don't want you to be afraid of us. Aside from the sightings of the male spirit, there is also eyewitness accounts of a little girl's spirit known as Olive, who apparently had her funeral ceremony in this building. We decide to use a LiDAR mapping device. Okay, we are using a brand new piece of equipment. This is a LiDAR mapping system. Basically, it's like radar. And what you can see here is this center line here in kind of the bullseye circle. This center line is where the actual LiDAR device is. You can actually see it spinning on top, just like you would any other radar system. So what's even cooler is it still can pick up things behind it. So these dots here, this is me. Right. And this is gonna be Billy, because he's right. closest to it. But I'm just gonna show you right now. Aaron, yeah. I want you to walk into the field of view here okay. and just yep. go down there. Now, this is Aaron here. Do you see that? A blip on the radar. Aaron, keep going, keep going, keep going. Stop there, Aaron. So where are you right now? Right by the pen. Okay, so we're picking up everything just before the bowling alleys. Yep. So this whole area here is where the machines are, where the ball pops up and everything like that. Now this thing is pinpoint accuracy, 100% accuracy. Put the candy right there, whatever you have. I want you to stay there, stay there. This is Aaron. Would you like some of this delicious candy or I don't know, play, do something? Whoa. Whoa. Did you hear the tapping? Whoa. Oh, dude, what the What? Oh, I can't tell. I swear I saw a huge shadow right by that door of, a, of a shoulders and the arm move. Move your guys' arms. None of us were moving. None of us were moving. What? Dude, whoa. What? I've never seen anything like that. What the hell did you see? Oh, God. Aaron. Basically, I'm looking at this, I see it when I'm in my eyes. I, I don't know, maybe it could be trickery or what, but I see like a shadow with shoulders, and then I see its arm move, and then I think it's maybe you guys or something, right? But you know how like there's depth between there and right in front of your eyes? This weird, like stringly black shadow looking thing just went right here, and I could see like the depth. It was almost like 3D. As Billy goes out to investigate what Aaron just witnessed, and you can see Billy represented here on the LiDAR, he experiences this. You're, what were you doing, just looking over there? I was staring at that door. And all of a sudden, it was just like, right in front of my eyes. Probably better with that lights on though, right? It's like a uh, tentacle of an octopus. Ow! 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 What the was? Ow! Well, something poked me like a needle, I swear to God. Serious? What the? What was that?